first day here was uh, very intense. Uh, it's very intense because we do a lot of acting and a lot of drawing. It's artistic. It's the most artistic of the three days of the course. What we're doing is bringing international masters who have worked with the finest companies in the world, Academy Award winners, Emmy Award winners, some of the top educators from around the world, specialists in things like acting and performance. And we're bringing them to China so that they can pass on their wisdom. Are really signature signs of, of contempt. Generally when you see those shoots coming out of your neck, that's a clear indication that you are in extreme distress. We're seeing puckering happening in his chin. You see that little dimple here and a dimple here and a dimple here and here and here. Well, China has the biggest scene in animation in the world. Uh, there are uh, approximately a half a million students in animation in China. That's an astonishing number. Um, to think of that number of people in that field, it's just it makes a lot of sense to come here and see if you know, see how the passion is, how the creativity and the talent is. Well, I think the most exciting thing in the last two years has been to Dao. Uh, the opportunity to join this group has really been phenomenal. It was an opportunity which, when it came to me, was something I just couldn't pass off. Only once in a lifetime do you have the opportunity to do a project like this. We're going to build a complete production pipeline for training and production. So the students who are going to come in will be early career professionals. We're not teaching people how to use software. We're teaching people about content. We're concerned about story. We're concerned about character. We want to make Chinese characters come alive. We want to tell Chinese stories because they're going to enhance China's stature in the world in the years to come. Highlights of the day, gotta say, is this uh, method actor. He uh, did those seven basic emotions and that serves as reference for the students, right? That they've got uh, with them that they can refer to some really genuine emotion. Again, those seven emotions that I was talking about before. We got some great emotional intensity that they can use for their facial animation. Reference material is everything in acting out. Reference material is how you observe the characters that you ultimately want to animate. Because what you see in a real person acting out real emotion is the timing. And timing is everything when it comes to facial animation. And that's what having reference footage, having reference material is so good at getting animators to be skilled at doing that. The challenge that exists in China right now is the problem of making films that truly have a universal quality. That is, they have enhanced the Chinese culture, the Chinese sociology, but at the same time, they're accessible to people in other parts of the world. So we want to help China develop a global quality animation industry. 